Hello, this is Debbie seidel -Bickey, and I'm CEO of Dental Hygiene Solutions, powered by Dental Practice Solutions. And this month in Dentistry Today, on the front cover of the journal, you'll see that I am one of Dentistry Today's top consultants. Today, I wanted to talk to you, and all throughout the month of November, I will address the new gingivitis code and what it means for dental professionals and our patients. And this week, I want to share with you the reason why this new scaling code was added to our CDT codes. Our current CDT codes only allow for documentation of procedures for patients with a healthy periodontium and or patients with periodontal disease that has accompanying loss of attachment. The CDT code D1110 is primarily a preventive code. And for many years, the CDT codes D4341 and 4342, those have been used as therapeutic procedure codes and they're indicated for patients who require scaling and root planing due to bone loss and subsequent loss of attachment. What we have been missing here is a CDT code to report therapeutic treatment of patients with generalized moderate to severe gingival inflammation with or without pseudopockets, but exhibiting no bone loss. And this new code is music to our ears. It's the gap filled with our new code, which is D4346. Now there are probably some questions that you are asking, so let me provide a few answers in today's video and the blog, and then I'll be back each week during November to answer more questions. One of the questions that we're getting is, can the new code D4346 procedure, is it appropriate to use for a more difficult prophy patient? Other questions are, can we use the new code when more time than usual is required to remove plaque, calculus, and excessive staining from tooth structures in order to control irritational factors? Some of you have asked, what if a patient's overdue for a hygiene appointment and we just need more time? And then there's this other question, there's so many other questions, but those questions I just listed now, the answers are a simple no. The new code, D4346, is used only when there's generalized moderate to severe gingival inflammation in the absence of attachment loss. In other words, the procedure is based on diagnosis rather than intensity of the treatment required. The key words here are attachment loss, the absence of this, and the other key word here is diagnosis nothing to do with the time or difficulty of the treatment required. Next week, I will be back to answer more questions about this new code. I'm going to wish you a great week, and I'll see you next week.